And there's the smallest perch in the world. Look at how tiny he is. Smallest red fin ever. Oh. All of about four inches long, maybe. Got anything yet? No. Oh, I got another one down the bottom there too. I dropped them on the lift. Finally, just got a nice ready. Of course, I didn't have the record going. Now, I don't want to focus on it. Let's get the lure out. Down there, what are you doing? Okay. Oh, that's not a bad size, ready. I'm going to have a few of those for a session. Okay, Ben's just got onto a car. Good run. Working back again. Oh. Hey, I'll give you a second. Ben just hooked up on a car. Yeah, right. Oh, no, you got a net. Wow, we got a net today. Civilised. Keep that bend in your rod, mate. Stop whipping it back towards the car. Control the drop. It's losing size. Oh, he's a monster. No, he's not a monster. He's only a decent size. It's, it's a nice catch, though. Baby, how are you? What's that? Very curious, isn't it? Hmm? What's the fish? Carp. 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 Yeah, you... uh, Not as evil as people make out. Thought, 
Come on. That's what number four, number three, decent and one tiny. Well, I wouldn't call any of them decent. So, packages have been turning up at my place with regularity. And in each of those packages, is a plenty of lures. Big lures, cod lures, bone lures, all sorts of lures. Over the next couple of weeks, small lures for, uh, for a golden perch and redfin, that type of thing. Over the next couple of weeks, I'll be unpacking all of these packages. There's a pile of boxes there, and I'll be talking about lures. How they swim, what they, what action they have, how their various shapes and sizes and bibs affect their action. That's a potato cod lure. Nice wide bib and nice wide action. Look forward to uh, trying them out. And I've got a couple of new rods and reels. I'll see them when I get them get down on the water. So, plenty of stuff to come in the next couple of weeks. <laughs>